Macca's guides. <laughs> Hey everyone, Mac here playing Trials Fusion. This is the Unyielding 3 achievement slash trophy. Before we get started, pro tip number one, if you tap your brake while pressing the gas, you can rotate forward while in the air without leaning. Pro tip number two, it's always better to land on your back wheel than your front wheel while going for this achievement slash trophy. Now for this achievement slash trophy, we'll need to complete three tracks. The first one here is Turbine Terror. I'll be using the Roach on all three of the tracks. And for the achievement, we'll need to complete all three of these tracks without using the lean button. So you cannot touch the lean of your rider. So what that means is you need to control his complete movement using only the throttle and the brake. Now for this track, you just want to maintain your speed. And as you see here, I am facing the sky with my front wheel. So I did use pro tip number one to kind of rotate my bike a little bit forward. Unfortunately, I do land here uh, a little bit abruptly, but... That shouldn't be a problem for you guys anyways. And for this track, you just want to maintain a good amount of your speed and make sure you're always landing on your back wheel and you're landing on the downward slope of the next ramp. This one's not too bad. Again, you don't want to gas up a hill too fast or you will pop a wheelie and fall off the back of your bike. And you also don't want to brake too abruptly or else it will send your rider flipping over the handlebars which will also give you a fault and screw over this achievement. Again, you have to complete these tracks with no faults as well. Track number two is Cliffhanger. This one's uh, not too bad, although there are some tricky parts, but I'll show you guys the best ways to do them. Off the very start, make sure you hold your brake so you go a little bit backwards. Just slowly roll down these two ramps. Now full gas up here. You want to land on the downward slope of that ramp and then just take your time, bounce off that ramp, and then slowly accelerate up this uh, ramp as to not wheelie too much you'll land on this area and then continue a little bit forward now there's only one really tricky part of this entire uh, map you want to make sure you are accelerating off that ramp if you don't accelerate you will face too far downwards and you'll land on your front wheel here just take your time and make sure you make uh, the distance but don't go too far and then you'll want to just slide back to where you came from and then slowly go up the ramp and make sure you land on the platform in front of you again you'll do the same thing landing on here now this is probably the trickiest part and I recommend gunning it full full speed and then using the pro tip number one to rotate your bike forward um, otherwise that ramp is very hard now just maintain your speed go up and over and that should be the track in about a minute and uh, you know uh, some riders may find that they need a little bit of practice which is completely normal this game is quite difficult and I've been playing it a very, very long time. So practice makes perfect in trials. And track number three, Bungalow Beach. This one's definitely the hardest in my opinion. You just want to gun it forward, get up onto here. Now the hardest part of the map is definitely this part. You want to go downwards here on your front wheel and then uh, gun it. And as you're coming off that little hut, your back wheel is going to hit the dirt first and you're going to go up and over. This part, just gun it up and you'll make it down here. Uh, slowly go up onto here and then full throttle up onto there again full throttle off the ramp and you'll make it up here full throttle again and once we land take your time going up this ramp don't go too fast you might smack your head on that top lip uh, take your time go very slowly off of here and then you will bounce off the ramp into the water and then once we're at the bottom of this ramp just take your time going up without wheeling too much and you should have no problem Hopefully that was helpful. You can also watch the replays in slow motion by using the YouTube feature in the bottom right of the video player. Hopefully that was helpful to you guys. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe if you found the video useful. And hopefully, i see you next time. Peace.